Sports and the Corn Ferry Tour are proud to bring you this year's Q School Final. It's time to get underway, so let's get into the coverage of this exciting event. Luke Elvey here alongside Rich Beam, and Rich, you know exactly how challenging these Q Schools are. Luke, all the players in this field want one thing and one thing only, and that is their Corn Ferry Tour card. It's a massive accomplishment. Let's see how this all shakes out. The top 50 on the leaderboard will get their card. Big day coming up. Can't wait to see how it unfolds, Rich. This should be an absolute beauty. Absolutely tattooed that one. Oh, look at this, right down the throat. Well, that's beautifully judged. What an opportunity to make a birdie. They've made it. Off to a great start today. Absolutely. You love to see those going in early. It sets the tone for the rest of the day. Getting off to a great start at this event. Can't birdie them all unless you birdie the first, Luke. Good start. Welcome to this par five hole. Not a bad line, this one. Time for the second shot here on the second hole. Always like it when they take the big dog and let it rip from the middle of the fairway. That almost went down. And this putt is for a big four on the scorecard. Now that's a mistake. How do you leave that short? Just nine feet remaining to the hole. Hey. 
Oh, wonderful effort. Confirms the par. Currently one under for the day. Here we are at the third. The tee is yours. Looks like they've got the five wood. Oh, that's a lovely looking shot into birdie range here at the third. This is a good chance. Oh. And they'll walk away with a par on this one. Let's take a look at the leaderboard as it stands. He's currently sitting in second. Let's see what happens here on the fourth. Looking shot this. From around 170 yards here, one stroke off the lead. Going with the six iron here. Well, good looking shot here. That's headed towards the green. Wow, what a shot. Trying to get to two under with this putt. It's got a chance. Oh, so close. Well, this would be a good one to make. It's for par. Well, that hole's behind us. More to play. And right to the top of the leaderboard after that effort. The leader now has a one-stroke advantage. We've arrived at a par four hole. Well, I like the look of the line here. It should find the fairway. From about 130 yards here.
I like that strike. This one's hitting well towards the green. And hitting yet another green here in regulation. Well, the practice is paying off here, Luke. This player is relentless. Just 10 feet to the cup here. that good birdie and that will take him to two under and this is quality play still on top of the leaderboard we have a par four on this one Looks like they put a good swing on that one. That should find the short stuff. Time for the second shot here at the sixth. Going with the five iron here. This one might need to sit. But not a bad approach, that one up onto the green. A couple of putts from there, and that'll be a pretty good hole. And this one for back-to-back -back birdies. 16 feet to the hole. Just missed. And that should secure the par. Well done. And after that hole, this is how the leaderboard looks right now. He's currently tied for first. off here at the seventh this one looks to be heading for the sanctuary of the fairway A couple under at this stage, currently tied for top spot. The interesting choice of the driver here. Yeah, well, it might not be on the green, but it's right up near the surface. Getting ready to play their third.
This would be a great up and down. Go ahead and make it. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Chip in for birdie. That's always a nice feeling. And let's have another look at that one. Leading by a couple after that hole. Oh, and they increase their lead. This is impressive, Luke, but can they hold up this play? Let's see what happens here at the eighth. Wow, that was just striped. John, you're down there. How's this ball lying? Well, hopefully they can get it out of this first cut. It ended up nestling itself down in there pretty good. Yeah, good swing. This one's heading up onto the green for sure. A great shot here at the eighth and a chance for birdie. Nice one. Fourth birdie of the day. Back to back birdies moving the right direction there, Luke. Currently four under for the round. Teeing off here at the ninth hole. Going with the five wood. Outstanding approach shot. Lining up the birdie putt here. It's half a chance of being hold this one. And another one goes. And with it, an increase of his lead. And with that, he'll move to five under par. All right, Rich, we've made the turn now into the final nine. What are your thoughts so far? Yeah, fantastic round today. Lots of golf yet to be played. Lots of great players chasing this player. Let's see if they can keep up the good work. Nicely done. Time for the second shot at the 10th. And it's just about three feet away. You don't want to miss these. And that part will give them birdie number six on the day. And that will move him to six under par. 
managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard. Always positive coming off a birdie. Let's see what happens here. Oh, that is crushed. Time for the second shot at the 11th. It's a brave one. Driver off the deck. Well, this person displays the power game in pure fashion there. Two big hits there, knocking in on this par five and two. Oh, this is exciting. A putt for an eagle. Oh, that would be an outstanding to make the eagle. And they'll tap this in for birdie. Oh, what a round this is. Seven birdies today. And that will take him to seven under. Our current leader is enjoying a six-stroke advantage. That should find the fairway. Coming off a string of five birdies. Looks to be going with the five iron. That might be one club too many. Well played, mate. Well, this is one of those lengthy putts. John, how do you see it? It's looking like about 23 feet to the cup. Go in. It was on a good line. Par putt coming up here. In she goes. Let's head to the next. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. Teeing off here on the 13th hole. Well struck. Time for the second shot here at the 13th.
Fingers crossed for a good kick to the left. Yeah, not a bad shot, that one. Trying to get to eight under par with this putt. Frustrating. And with that, you can go and put a par on the card. And after this hole, that's how it looks. And staying right where they were in today's rankings after that. Par threes are always fun. See if you can knock it close. Oh, this one should find the surface. Good shot, this. And he's safely on the green with that shot. And John, uh, how long's this putt? It seems to be a fair way. I'd say about 26 feet or so to the cup from here. It's like they just forgot to hit it, Rich. Sometimes when you try and get it up the hill, you just forget to hit it sometimes, and seems so in this case. And down it goes. Leading by six strokes after that one. Let's see what happens here on the 15th. Yeah, this is a quality looking shot, this one. That should find the short stuff. Second shot here on the 15th. Going with the hybrid. Come on, get down. Not bad. Butting for birdie. Not sure how that putt came up shy. It's downhill the entire way, and yet unexplicably comes up short. And down it goes. Let's head to the next. 
He sits in first position. Here we find ourselves on the tee of a par four. That one's heading down Broadway. Time for the second shot at the 16th. That dog will hunt. Always nice when you can just go ahead and tap one in for birdie. And he just keeps putting a gap on the rest of the field. What a putt to hold. And that will take him to eight under. Now, current leader is enjoying a seven stroke advantage. Let's see what happens here at the 17th. Opting for the five wood. Well, that's comfortably on the dance floor. Well played. Not a bad approach, that one. Not quite inside the birdie range, but you never know. Hold a long one. Still counts. Made birdie on the last. Looking for a second in a row here. Looking really good, this one. Oh, what a lovely putt to make. And I like it. Two in a row. He's feeling it. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. All right. One more hole to go. Let's see how you handle the 18th. That looks to be a fairway finder to me. Sitting at nine under par, currently in the lead. Interesting choice of the driver here. Well, that's a tremendous shot and sets up a wonderful opportunity. Using all of his muscles to get that one home in two. This putt is about 10 feet from the hole. Their short game today has been absolutely sublime fun to watch. Get excited. This could go in. Ouch, that hurts. This putt coming up is for birdie. And that brings an end to the day. So there you have it in the house in top spot after the opening round. Everyone likes to get off to a fast start and they certainly have.
Luke, big lead to the opening 36, but no time to get complacent. There's still a lot of golf to play, and they need to continue to make birdies in order to finish ahead. I'm Luke Elvey, alongside Rich Bean, and on behalf of all the hardworking folks at HB Studios, it's goodbye for now.